Hi guys! Welcome to another episode of Lin's Lunatic Loots. So another of my Taobao buys have arrived and in fact I have already cut out another one during the 1111 sales. So while waiting for the other batch to arrive, I thought I better unbox this soon. And there's actually some special episode coming up the next one or two video. So can't wait to share with you guys but for now, let's unbox this! Okay, so I've decided to take out all the parcel from the plastic first because for the previous video, I find that the plastic sound is a bit irritating. So I thought that, okay, this time around, I'll just take it all out and then I'll unbox together with you guys to minus the distraction. Wow! So that is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'll put on the floor for now because um, the wrapper is a bit dirty. So later when I take out the clothes from the poly mailer, then uh, I'll put it on my bed. So right now, seven, eight, nine, And the rest are shoes. One, two, three, four pairs of shoes. Okay, why uh, I suddenly bought so many shoes, right? Or should I say heels? Because my friend has been complaining that I've been wearing too much slippers. So even on certain occasion whereby they feel that my dress should have matched with heels, I wore my slippers instead. So I've decided to cut out. And these slippers that I found on Taobao actually looks pretty much um, the same like some shop I see out there. So now I'm going to try the quality and hopefully if they are good, I guess I'm going to buy more. Okay, let's start the unboxing. So after um, taking out the clothes from the Poly Miola, I realized that this batch, right, we actually have quite a bit of white and nude clothes. So I do not know how uh, this unboxing is going to be because yeah, I'm still a little skeptical on white clothes. But I do check out the reviews um, to make sure that they are not so sure. Hopefully it's all trustable. So let's start! Okay, first up. It's actually a short. Okay, material-wise, seems okay. Not too flimsy, pretty thick. Size-wise, I think it's okay also. Okay, so usually I don't really buy shorts or bottoms from Taobao because um, when they arrive, it's either their size they don't fit. If not, even with the size fit, right, normally the leg here, you know, the tie part, the cutting is very weird. But I've seen through this review, I've seen the measurements. So hopefully, um, this will fix well. Okay, so this is the shorts. I think for the first time ever, I finally got the shorts right. The fitting is good. And the cutting seems good also. It's not very weird. So yeah, I finally got a nice looking shop. Okay, next up. Okay, it's a off-shoulder top. Seems pretty okay. Material-wise, it's a bit sure. Because if let's say I put my hand, I'm not sure you can see, you can actually see my hand. So this is pretty sure, you yeah, definitely have to go with new undies. Um, I don't really like this kind of material reason being you actually have to iron it. And people who know me, I'm actually a very very lazy person. So normally my clothes that I wore is yeah, crumpled as it is because I don't really iron my clothes. But I like this design. I like um, this off shoulder design. I like the, the front part whereby it's a bit stretchable. Feels a bit huge though. So let's try it. Okay, this is the crumpy top. After trying, um, it seems okay. The length wise is fine. The fit here is good also. The only thing is that um, I think because I got fat arm, so this part is a bit tight. When I do this, do this, it'll be tight. So I'm afraid if I were to lift to get something, most probably this one will be up. Yeah, I think it will be up. Confirm. So while the fit here is good, but arm wise, it's either I slim down a bit more or yeah, I don't think I'll keep this. So this is a neck 
for girls who are definitely slimmer, you have slimmer arms. If you want this, just let me know. It's good like kind of material, just, just that you need to iron it. This fit here is good, it's just yeah, the sleeve for me. So if you want this, comment below, I'll give it to you. Because this is definitely a nail for me. Okay? Okay, next up. It's a dress. Okay, this is um, definitely very sure. I'm not sure you all can see, but from the back, it's practically see-through in real life. Not sure if you all can see in the video, but it's super see-through though. Even with new undies, right, you can actually see through it, so... The material-wise, it's not very good. Design-wise, I quite liked it. A front low v-neck bustier and then the back is whereby you have to wear the stick-on bra. It's actually um bare back. If it's a little bit thicker or it's like have some extra inner lining, I think I'll keep this but because it's way too sheer. Unless I wear this to the beach, then most probably I'll keep it. If not, this is a nail. But for those of you who are okay with wearing slightly sheer clothes, you all kind of like it, then yeah, do comment below. I will give you this dress because I don't think I'll wear it. It's too sheer for my liking. So this is a nair. But anyway, I'll still try it and see how it goes. But right now, it's a nair. Okay, this green dress, can you all see it? It's actually not that bad. So only bad thing is it's slightly sheer. So right now, because it's in the day, so you can't really see it. So I don't know if I were to wear it to a dinner with um, very bright lights, will they even see uh, my undies? So this one is still a KIV. Of course, if nobody wants this dress, then uh, I will keep it. Most of it, I wear it out to a beach day. If any of you want it, then I think I will give it to you. Yeah, because fitting-wise, it's okay. The back also, but you know my bra stripe la, lazy. But yeah, this is how the back look like. So yeah. I think it's good for a beach day out. So most of it, I'll keep this for a beach day out. Yeah. Okay, the next item. Okay, actually I bought a mic so that um, I do sound louder over the video because with all the background, sometimes uh, it's hard to hear what I say. But I realized the mic I bought is not compatible with my camera. In fact, it's only compatible with my GoPro. But oh well, I'll use it for my travel video then. It's good. Next time you can hear me talk during my travel video. Okay, so this one, I think a lot of people are familiar with this. Yes, it's the padded shoulder top. Which I found it. Quite like this new brown color. Not like the usual black. I'm not really a black person. So actually if you realize through my unboxing video, there's very, very little black clothes. Because for me, right, if it's black, you cannot really see the design or the detail on the clothes itself so from far it just looks like a normal black dress regardless of how much design it has so usually I try to buy like white or other color so that at least it's visible the design is visible of course this is just a plain shirt just that I don't really like black anymore so I got this in brown looks good I think this is definitely a keeper so of course I'll try it later but right now I like this okay this top uh, I think needless to say um, it's a very basic padded shoulder top. So definitely this is a keeper. You can either match it with your shorts like this. Or you can match it with a high waist jeans, black jeans, blue jeans. So yeah, material wise is good. The padded seems okay also. Most probably I'll buy other colors like black or white. Um, yeah, for my next few batch. I think I'll go back to the link to buy more colors. So yeah, this is definitely a keeper. Okay. Yeah, so you see there's a lot of new. So another moment of truth. Oh, this is a swimsuit. Wow, yes, I forgot I bought this swimsuit. But I remember in picture it's kind of a darker brown. But this is like practically new. But it seems fine. It's supposed to be yeah like this. So this one I will not try it because it's a swimsuit. And this is how it is. How you see is how it is. You can't go any other uh, 
way and then definitely stretchy so I think I can feel it of course so yeah this will be a keeper so if you all want to buy this kind of swimsuit the link is below yeah just grab it I don't think it's expensive in fact I think I saw a lot of other similar one which I thought of cutting it out also maybe I will start to buy the other design for the next few batch um, it's padded so you all have to look for extra padding even though the color is not what I expected but I think overall it still seems okay so this will be a keeper the next up a white top and I am right it's sure yeah so this is why I don't really like to buy white clothes because yeah it's see-through not sure you can see me but it's super see-through so likewise of course new undies but it will be good if it's made of a thicker material and you know it's more of an opaque instead of see-through so oh yeah I expected this last time when I buy white clothes it's also like that design wise I like it because it's just like a top you can match with a high waist uh, bottom high waist jeans but since the design is like this right most probably I will match it with a white inner spec top so it's still not that bad so I think right now this can be a keeper just that in Singapore I don't really like to layer my clothes because it's really hot and I'm afraid of the heat but I think I can wear this overseas when the borders open so I really like this kind of um, crop shirt kind of design so I think I'll KIV and keep it for now but in any case if any of you like this and want this then of course please comment below if I decided to change my mind then I'll give it to you okay right so after I pair it with an inner top it doesn't feel that bad anymore in fact the material wise is a bit cooling I really like um, the design to match with like a high waist bottom so feels comfy even though sure but with the white top is fine so I think this will be a keeper yeah I think this will be a keeper for me now yeah yes it will be a keeper next up is also a white item moment of truth um, um, let me try to figure out because it seems very small okay this one I know from picture is supposed to be a top so this is where is the off shoulder and then this is one of the sleeve that show the middle part is stretchy so it's fine okay actually I think can lah later when I try this one not sure whether I like it or not material wise the bottom is sure has usual white items so far all has been disappointing but because of the middle part there's extra layer so the middle part or should I say the boobs part is not um, translucent so it's fine now is to see whether it's comfortable to wear and how's the cutting like because from this look it doesn't feel or looks pretty comfortable so I will try it so after trying it doesn't feel that bad I think this one is supposed to be low like that so of course I have to tuck it in but I think fit wise it feels okay the sleeve is a bit weird but I think can lah for a normal basic top out for like day out with my girls and all simple day out so yeah I think this will be a keeper right now and the last white item okay this one material wise feels good extra lining not sure this is good I like this so this is how do I wear this ah it's like that okay so this is the top okay right now I think I like it I can imagine we're pairing it with either a black pants or a high waist jeans so this will be a keeper material wise it's good so, so if only all the white clothes come in such material then yeah it will be good but nah normally you see this batch I think got at least three or four is KIV and then one nair so oh well maybe next time I'll start to buy other color instead of white clothes but this is good I'm happy with this
Yeah, this is the top, so you can just match it out like that also. So the top wise, yes, definitely you have to go with a high waist shorts or a high waist jeans. But material wise is good, fit is good. Yeah. So yes, these both are a keeper. The last clothes item. Let me see. Oh, it's a dress. Yeah, so this uh, badge, I'm, you can see I'm more into the color palette of new uh, white color kind of clothes. So this is actually a dress. Seems good. Oh, is it? oh, it's a romper. So it's a romper dress. Okay, this one I can wear out for brunch date. So, okay, slightly... Slightly sure, but not as bad as the white. So this one is okay. I think you wear new undies, uh, you can't really see it. So right now, based on fitting, I feel it's okay. Kind of like it. So this will be a keeper, but of course, I have to try. Right, I actually like this romper dress. Mainly because, yeah, here is actually sewed on. So you don't need to get jiao geng. So this is what I like about most uh, dress or top. If they have either button here or they sew it. Then, uh, yeah, there's extra brownie points. I like the flutter sleeve. Fitting wise is good. See, it's a romper dress. So, yeah, this make for an easy, casual brunch date or a lunch date with friends or boyfriend. So, this definitely keeper, you just throw it on and you're good to go. Of course, I'll match it with my white heels instead of slipper. And, yeah, this is good. And now, we have moved on to shoes. Yes. Okay. Um, of course, I won't be wearing the shoes because it's a bit hard to show you guys because I have very limited space at home. I can't be walking on my bed with my heels even though it's brand new but uh, better not. So, let's start. I will try to put it on my hand. You all can just imagine or figure it out. So, the first one. Okay, I can't really remember what design I bought because too many to remember and I think there's a lot of similar that I add to cut but eventually I need to choose four to check out so let's see excited first ah ah this looks okay so the strappy white heels yeah I think y'all will find this design super familiar so I found a lot of this kind of shoe online in Taobao and they are all damn cheap so guys go and get it from the link below Y'all will definitely like it. You can save a lot of money. And ta-da! Looks good. This is how it looks like. Yeah. So this is okay. I can match this with my jeans. And some dress. So my girls won't say that. Why are you always in slippers? So I think they will be happy that I bought this. Ta-da! Yeah. Looks good. Material wise, it's kind of like a soft leather. I'm not sure this is fake or real leather, but since it's from Taobao, it's so cheap, most probably it's fox leather. But right now, I kind of like it. This is size 35. Ah, yeah, let me try a bit. Lah. I want to see whether it's true to size or not. Yeah, can you see? Can you see? Oh my god, I'm going to cram. Okay. So um, for this right, if you're getting it from the link directly, I think you can get one size smaller because usually I am a 36 but this is a 35 and fits me just nice but normally I don't really see sizing, I'll see the CM because I know I'm around, if I'm not wrong, 225 or 230 so normally I see some 35 is like 225, some 36 is 225 so I go according to that CM instead of 35 or 36 but right now for this I'm usually a 36 and this 35 fits me well so I'm not sure whether you guys want to get like one size smaller or you prefer I mean to take a risk you can just get a usual size it will just be slightly bigger I feel but this will be a keeper definitely can you see yeah this is simple and nice so I will keep this okay the next one Okay, this is a nude heels. Okay, I try to buy different color so that uh, and different design so that they don't all look the same. But it's still the same kind, the strappy kind. 
So this is just two strap, simple two strap. Likewise, I think you all have seen this design before somewhere. I'm not going to try this already. I think all the size fit. This is 36, you see? 36. So I also do read the comments. Sometimes under the reviews, right, people do say that, oh, it, it runs like one size smaller or it runs one size bigger. Then I will also get it accordingly. Of course, I still see the measurements first. So this new one is good. Feels the same as the white one. But I feel that the white leather is slightly softer. But yeah. Yeah, I think this one can match with a lot of dress. So nude. Likewise, your one is in the link below. And it's very cheap. Okay. Another nude. Yeah, I only bought nude and white, I think. I don't think I get any um black heels. Because, yeah, not a fan of black items. Don't know why. So those of you who like black, um, yeah, sorry you can't get much from this video. But you can click the link. I think they are black colors. So still use the link, but then go and choose your own color. So this one is also strappy heels. So I got all kind of strappy heels because I feel that uh, it's very simple to match. Easy to match and it looks good as well. So no fancy full design since I'm already not a heel person. Getting me to wear this is already hard enough. So yeah, this one is a four strap. So it's a 4 shred versus a 2 shred. Color wise is the same. Yeah, so different design. I kind of like both. So definitely I will, be, I will keep it. So this is how it looks like when worn roughly. Yeah. I think so far all the heels. Okay. Previously I bought quite a bit of work shoes from Taobao. So, and I will say all of them are really good. In terms of material, it's soft wise. But of course, all the shoes are about um, 5 to $10 per pair. So they don't last long. So I have to give you a heads up that Taobao shoes don't last long. Either the side will come out like after a while. Somehow I wore it daily for work. So it will like spoil pretty easily. But since it's only 5 to $10, you can just buy another pair. Yeah, so and you see down there. I'm a 230. Here, okay, I'll see it's 230. And for Taobao, of course, um, sometimes it will come in very funny design. So like this, like this. <laughs> so do you see? Can you see? Uh, there's some funny, funny alphabet here. But yeah, bottom, you walk, no one will see it. So it's fine. For the price, I'm fine. Everyone look at the surface only. So yeah. So if you like this, yeah, click the link below. Yeah, okay, I think I really quite like the heels because firstly, they are all very short heels. All very short. So this is the white one. It's all very short heels. So maybe because of these few pairs, I'll start wearing heels again. But no lah, I still prefer slippers. After all, I feel it's the comfiest thing ever. Slipper is always the best to go. But sometimes if you really go like a wedding lunch, then no choice lah. You have to wear a bit of heels. The last shoe... Oh, this is green. But it's not very green. But I think the photo looks even more green. Okay. Green-wise, I still don't know how I can match it. But look-wise, the strap is okay. Doesn't look very funny. The green is quite subtle. So this one, I think I'll try it. Lah, because I do not know how green will look like on my feet. Can you see? Ah, my leg. Okay. I think looks wise, it's fine. The strap is okay. The size is okay. The heels is a bit wide. But overall, I think um, it looks good. Just that I need to think of what clothes to match. Most probably I'll match with white top. Yellow top. Yeah, and I think black dress or black top is fine also. So, oh well, since I got two, a eh, one white and two nude, I think that's the reason why I bought the green, something different. Yeah, because I really don't like to buy the same design, different color, or different design, the same color. So, I think that's why I bought this green one. It seems fine. So, yay! I'm very happy with all my shoes. Bye! Okay, so we have come to the end of this unboxing video. So overall, I only have two items. One which is this top, 
which is a name for me. So and if you all want this, then let me know. And one is this green dress, which is a KIV. So likewise, if any of you want it, then please uh, comment below and let me know. So after all, I think it's not a bad batch because uh, even though some doesn't look very nice on the surface, but when you try it, it's actually not bad. So likewise, there are also clothes in the past whereby it looks good, but when you try it, the fitting is... Uh, so I think doing this unboxing video and trying all the spots really really help a lot so I know what to keep and what not to keep immediately in a way. So yeah, I'm happy with this batch. Okay, so uh, thank you guys for watching. For the next video, there's going to be a special episode which I can't wait to share with you guys. If you all want to know what is the special episode is going to be about, stay tuned for the next video. So uh, like this video if you can. Subscribe to my channel to be updated of new unboxing video. And yeah, I'm happy to share all my cheap buys and great deals with you guys. So enjoy shopping. Bye. See you in the next video.